and we actually have a boss overlord trump what up everybody this is pac trump vr it's pac-man trump vr and a load of other craziness rolled into one game so let's get into it right from the get-go you're greeted with this tweet from trump where he wants to build the greatest maze the world has ever seen so the story of the game is pretty simple, Trump has built this maze of walls to protect his we golf balls losers. since golf balls are clearly important to presidential duties. You need to grab, oh there's a Trump, you we need to grab losers. all the golf balls before losing your three lives. So it's quite similar to Pac-Man where rather than grabbing the coins you're grabbing golf balls. So you guys can probably already hear the Trump spamming the usual Trump game. phrases and because the game is created using spatial 3D sound, the closer they are to you the louder we they get, losers. just like the real thing. Nothing but problem. Nothing but problem. Oh, and we just got pincered by a squad of Trumps. So you can see that red screen flash effect when we lose a life. And into the handy dandy poorly modelled portal system we go, which teleports us to the opposite end of the map. Quite similar to the Pac-Man games. Now, just to make the game a little bit more spicy, there's a special feature once you hit a score of 1250. And we actually have a boss overlord Trump with his red, white and blue swag. Oh, not that way. So the boss Trump himself is a lot faster than smaller Trumps. So the design of the AI for the Trumps was pretty cool. It's basically recalculating the shortest vector distance between the Trump and the player whilst taking into consideration physical things such as the walls of the maze. I'm in competition with them. Know me like we have losers. And I said, we need to build a wall. People that know me are like, hey, I'm really rich. Somebody from China. Nothing, nothing but, but problem. problem. Nothing but problem. I'm really rich. I'm in competition with them. Playing the game does feel a little bit like torture because you're forced to listen to him spamming his phrases. Oh, and there's the Trump squad. So as you can see, we've only got one life left. So let's just see if we can actually survive this maze. I'm really rich. We have losers. Nothing but problem. And into the seizure inducing unity particle effects we go. I want to make the country great again. Somebody from China. Japan. And I said, we need to build a wall. Trying to kill us. Nothing but problems. We have losers. I'm in competition with them. Somebody from China. Nothing but problems. I want to make the country great again. Maybe winning. Trying to and kill us. Said, hey. So the game itself was built using Unity and C Sharp code, and the VR aspect of it was integrated using Google's VR SDK. Women's health issues. Trying to kill us. Somebody from China. I'm really rich. I want to make the country great again. People that know me like I want to make the country great again. I want to make the country great. And we say bye bye. And we're dead. With Trump saying bye bye at the end. So when you're dead, you get brought back to the screen where you can enter your name and score. That brings us back to the home screen. So thanks so much for watching guys. Don't forget to hit that like button and please subscribe for future content and I'll see you in the next one. See ya.